Right, this is this is a glue trap which was found locally. Um, it doesn't fit this type of machine, but the machine it fits has a door which lifts up, money comes out, and the door goes back down. This was stuck over the front of the machine, it's got glue on here and your money sticks on that. So you think there's no money in the machine, you walk away, they come along, they take that off, whatever money is stuck on here, 20, 40, 60 pounds, they take that and then they put it back on again. This was fine in the firm line. This machine here, which has the new devices on it, when we found that machine that was found inside the machine, it's a health lottery play card with a pin number on the back. This is a cloned card, so this was actually used to take money at the machine. All they need to do is they re-educate the magnetic strip, which makes it the same as your card, and they can do that in about 10 minutes, and they have a cloned card. The reason the pin numbers on it is because they carry about 10 or 12 of these cards at one time. They can't remember the pin numbers, so they write the pin numbers on them. This latest device is the most worrying of the lot. This was found in Edinburgh. This goes inside the machine, so your chance of you actually finding this is very, very remote. All you would see if you saw anything was that very, very thin bar in there. But as you can see, that's been professionally made, laser cut. It's got little magnets on it that have been fitted in, so it slots inside the machine, drops down. When your card goes into the machine, it passes over this little button here, so your card goes right into the machine. When it's coming out the way, this little device here stops your card, so your card is then stuck, it won't come out of the machine. So that's stuck inside the machine. You walk away, they'll come along, they'll pull this out, they'll take your card with it, they've got your card, and they've got your, possibly got your PIN number from a camera. So this is obviously quite a worrying trend. Um, they must know the inside workings of the machine because there's a wheel runs up and down the side here. So that sits inside over the wheel and your card goes in as normal and then jams. So what we're telling people now is if your card is jammed in a machine, you should always get it cancelled. Because if they made one of these, they'll have made thousands of them.